Food is the last frontier for automation. Other essential manual tasks, such as manufacturing, have been automated, globalized, and streamlined to maximize efficiency. Somehow, food slipped. Food is vital to our daily lives, yet it remains manual, susceptible to labor changes and food contamination. For how long can we keep this reality? Is our connection to craft and food so great that it hides our need to protect against industry fluctuations and health concerns? Who suffers from this lack of change? Well, we all suffer. Ever been frustrated because your local restaurant closes at 8 p.m.? Alfred can solve that. Annoyed because your favorite chain is 20 miles away? Alfred can fix that. That's not real suffering, though. So who suffers the most from this lack of innovation in food service? Line cooks and back of the kitchen staff suffer the most. They're the ones on the front line in health crises like the current one. They're the ones whose roles are monotonous assembly line jobs with strict additional hygiene requirements. There's no room for soul or craft on a quick service restaurant's assembly line. There's only room to get things done. These unsung, underserviced heroes drove us to create Alfred. Instead of manning the line, these staff members can now become upskilled chef de technologie. They can now supervise a fleet of robots to assemble our meals, drastically improving their work conditions. With the whole restaurant industry on the line due to the current crisis, we need a solution now more than ever before. Alfred launches in late 2020, bring this dream to reality.